Hi, I'm Josh from Apt. Here's a second generation Play 5 from Sonos, who's really just a leader in having streaming audio all throughout your house without wiring anything. And it taps into all those internet stations and different apps, so you have really a great variety and you can control it all from your smartphone or tablet. And Sonos has been the best at it, and the Play 5 has been their real flagship powerhouse. And we've got some big updates, so let's look behind the grill. Behind the grill, we are going from three different drivers on the bottom. You've got, it used to be, two three-inch mid-range drivers and one three-and-a-half-inch subwoofer, replaced by three four-inch midwoofers. So you have a lot more power, and each one of these are really working for your mid-range, which is like instruments and vocals, as well as deep, rich bass. So you've got that covered. Above it, you've got three tweeters now instead of two. A center tweeter and two side firing tweeters. And they're all responsible for your high frequencies. So you have some major updates on the inside of the body. But on the outside, they've also updated their control panel. So instead of buttons we're pressing, they've added a touch control. I can go volume up by just touching it, volume down, and now I could swipe to go to the next track or swipe the other direction to go back a track. Those are great new features on the Play 5 second generation. And another thing they've done that's really cool is I could buy two of them. So I've got one Play 5 sitting over here, and eight to 10 feet over, I have a second Play 5. And they're both sitting horizontal in this example, and that's great, and it's gonna give you real good pro audio. The center tweeters on both are gonna be cut, so they're just not gonna be functioning. And that's so that things don't get all muddled coming across each other. But you have all six uh, four-inch mid-woofers, you've got the center tweeters and the side-firing tweeters in that example. So that's a great way to get amazing pro audio sound, or you're gonna go vertical. You can get two Play 5 set vertical, and again, eight to 10 feet over is where you're gonna station your second one. Now you wanna be about eight to 12 feet back over there because that's the optimal place for you to be relaxing listening to your music. If you're closer up, it's gonna be heavy bass. If you're farther beyond that, uh, you'll still get amazing separation and that's what's happening here by having two. But if you just bought one Play 5, you've created a great spot here. It's gonna to try to fill the room. You've got True Play. True Play is a whole new function that's gonna go ahead and analyze my space and see if it can calibrate these products to kind of adjust accordingly. For example, if I have a wall here and I have an open space here, when I run this utility, it's gonna see that it's not there's no walls to bounce off of, so it can adjust and compensate how we operate to give you better, fuller sound for the whole room. And then it's Sonos. So again, this needs to, to connect to your Wi-Fi network. And just like any Sonos piece, you have the option of now you can connect to Wi-Fi or you have the ability to utilize that boost unit. A separate Sonos part you're gonna plug into your wireless router. And now all your Sonos elements are connecting on their own separate network. Uh, highly recommend that no matter what. Even if you think your Wi-Fi is the best in town, having that separate sec set, uh, second section like that really has been the, the way Sonos always was. You had no other option. They recently gave us the ability to tap into our own Wi-Fi. And a lot of people's networks aren't perfect. And the audio can cut in and cut out. And maybe you just have a lot of people in the house, a lot of streaming going on. You have a lot of gamers, a lot of people using your network. And again, it's only two gigahertz networks that this is gonna join if you decide to do that. I doubt you have a five gigahertz only frequency, but if that was the case, that's why it's not working. So get the boost and you're good to go. We have the full line of Sonos products on app.com. Check it out, love to hear some comments.